Hi, welcome to Moo Moo Math. Today we are going to talk about applying the Pythagorean Theorem. So here is our example problem. A 12-foot ladder is placed 4 feet from the base of a wall. How far up the wall will the ladder reach? Okay, this is our example problem and I'm actually going to start with the rules of working with word problems in geometry. Okay, so here are the rules. The first rule is you always draw a picture. So get out your marker and draw a scenario of what this situation looks like. Looks like. Then I want you to label it. Take all the information and label it on that picture. And since this is the Pythagorean Theorem, we're going to identify where is A, where is B, and where is C. Then we're going to plug everything that we do know into the Pythagorean Theorem and solve for the unknown. So let's go through the steps. Okay, first step, let's draw ourselves a picture. So we have a wall, and here's our wall, and we have a ladder leaning against the wall. So here's my ladder, and now let's label what we know. We know this is a 12-foot ladder. So that means 12 is the length of the ladder. And it says it's placed 4 feet from the base of the wall. So that means here is my 4 feet. Now notice I've drawn a right angle. So let's label that because that identifies where our C is. Now opposite a right angle, that is our hypotenuse or C. That means the 4 is B and we are missing the side A. So now I've identified my A, B, and C. Now let's plug it into the Pythagorean Theorem. Let's go over here and I'm going to write A squared plus B squared equals C squared. And I'm going to plug in 4 for B and 12 for C. And I'm going to have to solve for A. So let's square these out. 4 squared is 16. 12 squared is 144 and I don't know my a squared. Now let's subtract 16 from both sides and let's see 144 minus 16 that's 8 20, 128 is equal to a squared and to do an undo a square I will square root it. So I have to find the square root of 128 so I'm just going to go over here to the side and I'm going to have to make myself a little factor tree. 2 times 64, and 64 is a perfect square, it's 8 times 8. So I take my pair out, 8 square root 2. So that is how long A is. You could also get the decimal version by originally going back and taking the square root of 128 on your calculator, but the radicand or the exact answer is 8 square root 2. Hope all these tips were helpful.